Hi there folks, quick guide setting up your ammo hub. If you're using the one inch male side release buckles here for your top attachments, there's two ways. The second best way is if you run your top attachment strap externally here, down the back of the hub and into this bottom loop. The reason that's second best is that this hook Velcro is different to this hook Velcro here and the stuff on the hub is stickier, basically. So what you want to do is run this strap internally in an ideal world. Now to do that, you get your one inch buckle that's provided. Now you want this middle serrated uh, marked bar, not the lower one, center one. You want that facing towards your body as you're wearing it. Take your strap through the bottom. And obviously at this point, you're gonna be setting your height. You've got a wide range of height adjustment given the length of this strap. And if you don't need it, obviously you can always just cut it shorter. So take that through the top. Now you can set your height at this point, of course. Wide range of height adjustment, as I say. You can pull the, uh, the one wrap past the buckle, like so, which is probably gonna work for most carriers. Now you're gonna wanna find this slot here, just below the top attachment. There's a slot right there. You're gonna feed the uh, one wrap, you want to keep a grip of it because it will try and grip on the inside. You're going to feed the one wrap strap all the way through and you'll have something that looks like that. Okay. Now on the inside, it's going to be hard to show, but basically lay the strap down the inside of the hub all the way down to the bottom and just, just tuck it in there following the contours of the panel. As you can see, you've got a clean attachment. The strap's not visible on the outside here. Just this little piece at the top. And this will stick to your carrier or your chest re expander, whatever you're attaching the hub to, it will stick at the edges where it matters most slightly better than if you have the strap running externally. So again, hopefully you can see it here. Try and run it internal. And uh, that's gonna be the best method for attaching your top buckles.